Hi, my name is Ray Nolan from Specialized Solar Systems and uh, I'd like to tell you about a successful commercial project that we've just implemented and finished for the Proto Hotel in Mossel Bay which forms part of the Marriott Group. Initially the mandate from the owners of the hotel and from the management of the hotel was to implement an energy system to assist them to reduce their overall running costs. After receiving the mandate from the hotel and the management to reduce their costs, we did a, a data logging process to determine their exact usage patterns and to design a correct size grid tied solar system. We also had to adapt the design because of the roof spaces available at the hotel. The hotel doesn't have one large north facing roof space. It has several different roof spaces and we also had to be very careful to be aesthetically pleasing uh, because it's a hotel where many international guests pay visits to. After all of that, we came up with a grid tied solution with a 54 kVA Fronius inverter and a 47.2 kilowatt peak solar array. Um, that was our final design. We then put that forward to the management with all the costs and we were approved. Our following step was to complete and submit an SSEG application, which is a small scale embedded generator application. Any energy solution that's being embedded into the main supply needs to be accompanied with an SSEG application. We did this to the Mossel Bay municipality and within a couple of weeks that SSEG application was approved. Our installation took us uh, just over two weeks. We had to work around the guests. We were only could come in at 10 o'clock in the morning and finish by three. So it was one of those projects where you have to work around the guests at the hotel. It was a very successful and very neat installation and we are currently overproducing what we estimated in the beginning and we are supplementing over 50% of the uh, hotel's current usage. What this means is, is that we are targeting between 25 and 30% of the hotel's overall electricity account. So as we supplement the kilowatt hours being used by the hotel, by the solar array during the day, we reduce the kilowatt hours that they use from the main supply. It's very effective because the hotel is open seven days a week, 365 days a year, and it's all for the hotel's own use. The technical side of it, the, the equipment that we used, uh, two 27 kVA Fronius inverters, one is the master, one is the slave. Uh, this was connected to the 47.2 kilowatt peak solar array. This is made up of 144 330 watt panels in strings of 19 to com DC combiner boxes with surge protection. Essentially that's the DC side of the system and then we brought in the AC electrical contractor who was familiar with all the AC works that need to be done at the hotel and he did our AC connection into the main distribution board for the hotel. The return on the investment on this system will be just at the end of year three going into year four. The capital payback period and break even point is then at three and a half years with a lifespan of the system being 25 years. The total return on the investment over that 25 year period for the hotel will be about seven and a half million rand. There is a tax incentive at the end of year one uh, any business can claim 100% tax rebate on the asset depreciation tax and that assists greatly on the return on investment. With the current tariff rates that municipalities are charging in the, in the Western Cape, these systems will pay for themselves typically between three and four years. Each of our uh, systems have a monitoring platform. These are live monitoring platforms that can be delivered to anybody's uh, smartphone or, or laptop or PC uh, within the Marriott Group or within the Protea Hotel. The Fronius Solar Web Live platform um, allows us as specialized solar systems to manage 
and administrate each and every system that we install. It also gives us a platform for uh, a live demonstration to anybody else when we are coming to uh, assist somebody with a new design for their business. So this SolarWeb live platform is something that businesses can use to demonstrate how they are reducing their costs and how they are going green and uh, the carbon emissions, uh, the, the savings of the carbon emissions that that business is doing. And it is a wonderful platform and I'd like to show you the, the system as we have on Mossel Bay right now live. So here is the SolarWeb live page for the Proteo Hotel Mossel Bay. And this is our current production and consumption patterns. Um, up here we can see the production pattern of the solar coming in at 30.4 kilowatts and then what the hotel is drawing over and above that is another 34.5 kilowatts from the municipal grid totaling 68 kilowatts. What this effectively means is currently the hotel is 45% self-sufficient with the solar array. And here we're demonstrating a perfect solar curve. So starting at uh, around about seven in the morning and perfectly increasing our solar production up to 12 o'clock during the day and then falling uh, off again towards six at night. And you can see that this falls into the consumption curve of the hotel. Um, and we total delivery of 217.14 kilowatt hours during that day, which is 17 kilowatt hours over what we said we were going to do uh, during the month of August. So this is an, a very effective tool, which um, the staff of the hotel can use, the management of the hotel can use to become more and more efficient electrically. Yes, the photograph of the um, main solar array. It also gives you weather patterns. It gives you total uh, carbon dioxide uh, savings. And eventually, as it starts to accumulate, it'll give you your earnings and your return on investment on your system.